What's up, guys? This is Jay Little back for more Pack Crackers. I am continuing my uh, CardKingdom.com battle deck openings. Uh, this time I have Last Rites, uh, which is a black and white deck uh, and battle decks. If you're not familiar, they're a 60 card ready to play deck that you can get from CardKingdom.com. They're not a sponsor, but if they want to be a sponsor, that'd be kind of cool. Uh, but this one, if do, it says, uh, if doing something evil helps the greater good, then don't two wrongs make a right? See see how they spelled right? See how they spelled it? Last Rites is a white-black deck that sacrifices its creatures to add counters, draw cards, scry, and gain life. This engine deck devours itself, so you can continue to generate value. Now, as far as the type of cards you get, you're not going to get, like, a $50 card in these things. That's for sure. Uh, and they're from all sorts of decks, so maybe do new decks that you've never played. It's, it's stuck. Get out. There you go. Uh, you also get a sweet plastic box to keep it in. Um, but like I said, you're not going to get, like, a huge value card or anything. Uh, but you know what? You get a deck, and you can... Upgrade it, change it, do whatever you want. And you also get a couple tokens. You get a soldier and a vamper. I'm going to go through these real quick. Uh, most of them, you get several copies of each card. Or a couple copies at least. You get four discordant pipers. Uh, you, get, you get that goat. I, he didn't get a goat token. That's kind of silly, but okay. Uh, Zephyr boots. Two of those. Uh, Silver Quill Campus and Scoured Barons and Hall of Starnheim and Great Hall of Starnheim. So you get some, get some dual lands there. Dual colored at least. Unruly Mob. This is a class. This is classy. This one. Especially when you're sacrificing stuff. That good. Rites of Oblivion. You get one, two, three of those. That's flashback, which is nice. Odric's Outrider. Not Odric himself, but Odric's Outrider. And you get four of them. Not a bad uncommon. A couple good uncommons so far. Novice Occultist. Uh, you also might not get any rares, or you probably won't get any mythics for that matter. Um, but you might get one or two in a deck. Of course, these are built around a certain mechanic, not necessarily rare cards or anything. We've got a Flesh Taker. Taking your flesh. He's taking it. He's taking it home. This is now uh, Cathar's Call. Boo, 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 boo. Then Bushmeat Poacher. I'm assuming if you buy more than one of each specific deck, like if you bought more than one of these, you probably get the same cards in it. I don't think they like update it or anything. They just build it. They have these cards ready to go. Bushmeat Poacher. Oh, we got a rare. Key to the City. Okay. Uh, two drop artifact. You can tap it to discard a card. Up to one target creature can't be blocked this turn. Whenever the key, whenever key to the city becomes untapped, you may pay two if you do draw a card. Oh, so you can do that like at your upkeep, get an extra card. Bone splinters, classic, especially if you're uh, if it's based around sacrificial creatures, sacrificing a creature to, to, to destroy a creature, pretty good. And then you got your planes, some swamps. And that will be it. So you get a, you got one rare, 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 in this card. Uh, you got some dual lands of all sorts, which are nice. Like I said, these aren't. You're not gonna win a, any kind of big tournament. You're not gonna win a modern term tournament if any of these cards are actually legal in modern. I know they're not legal in the standard, some of them. Uh, but you know it's gonna be, actually, no nope, Theros. But, you know, it's still a deck. Still a deck you get to play with. You get to upgrade it. You get to, get to change it. Modify it. However you see fit. So, there's that. And um, I have uh, five, six, seven, eight more of these to open. Which we'll get to in future videos of Pack Crackers. Uh, I'm still going to be doing, obviously, I'm still going to be doing regular pack openings. But I just wanted to switch it up, change it up. Do something other than just your regular, hey, here's a pack. I got that card again, like you saw several times already. But, this is something a little, something a little different. So that was Last Rites Battle Deck, 
uh, cardkingdom.com. Not a sponsor, but they should be $9.99 if you want to buy one. Anyway, guys, later.